Hello and welcome to another video tutorial by Synthetic Programming. This tutorial is on the encryption and decryption programs, which are sister programs, so they go one with the other. You should probably have both of them because only having one would be pretty useless. You don't want to encrypt something and then not be able to decrypt it. So, the first thing we're going to do is go to the Synthetic Programming webpage, which is, again, syntheticprogramming.co.nr and I'll have a link in the description of this video just in case somebody doesn't want to type it out so then we're going to go to codes and towards the bottom of the page there are the encryption programs so here's encryption and decryption they're split apart by h2 tags and the encryption program is this white text here and the decryption program is this white text here for those of you who don't want to go through the trouble of copying and pasting there is a download here, but off of Mediafire, I'm not sure if it would be the safest option, and it's not too hard to simply copy and paste the code and save it as a VBS script. So what we're going to do is, back at the codes page, we're going to copy the first code, which is the encryption code, and just do that one more time to be safe we're going to create a new text document and this time we're going to call it encrypt so in encrypt paste the code that you just copied and do file save as and this time instead of saving it as a BAT if you have watched our last tutorial we're going to save it as a dot VBS which is a visual basic script then we're going to save it to all files and keep the encoding as ANSI and hit save. We're going to exit out of this and here's our program right over here. So we're going to leave it where it is and we are going to actually leave this text document where it is except we are going to remain, rename it decrypt. Back at the synthetic programming webpage we are going to go to the decryption code and we are going to copy that, come back here to the decrypt text document and paste that in and we are going to save as the exact same thing dot VBS and all files. We can get rid of this now because we won't need the text document anymore and now you have your two files here. Encrypt, if you click it, will prompt you with this little box it says enter text to be encoded so let's try hello world if we hit OK it'll give us a text document that says some very hard to read string of letters and a number sign between them what we're going to do then is just copy that for now and we can exit out that is your encrypted message then we're going to open the decryption program which says enter text to be decoded and we can just paste in the code that we just copied when we hit OK you can see that it says hello world right here and there you have it a simple encryption and decryption program that can be used with your friends to exchange secret messages or maybe for another purpose your business might have to send emails that you would rather not have intercepted by a third party and that should be it Please rate, comment, and subscribe to our channel, and make sure that you tell your friends about synthetic programming because we're really trying to get the word of our site out there and help other people to become computer savvy. Thanks again.